G'day, I'm, I'm Pete Graham. I work for the Department of Conservation here in Whangarei and I'm part of the Kiwi team. On the side of the road in Pūrua, we're here with the community to show them how close these birds are nesting to the road and to their farm. We're in farmland here, we're not in the big bush and um, I think it's really important for these people out here to, to know where these birds are living so that they can uh, further help protect them. Around Christmas five years ago, on the other side of the mountain, we had a dog get into this reserve and kill seven of our radio transmitted adult birds. The dog may very well have killed more than seven um, and so we worked fairly closely with this community in those last five years trying to um, get them to be aware that Kiwi are living in their area and, and how they can help to, um, to keep them living here, to protect them. The school comes out um, regularly with us to visit Kiwi in the field and they get to appreciate how close Kiwi live to their properties and to their school. They've been involved with planting around their school. They do education programs to teach their kids and more importantly probably their parents about how vulnerable Kiwi are in this area and what they can do to help. The farmers also put their dogs through Kiwi aversion training so the dogs are educated to stay away from Kiwi and that's an important part of this as well as um, not only teaching the, the owners of the dogs about dog management but also the dogs themselves to stay away from kiwi. And this is the result of all that pr protection work. Um, this little fella's probably uh, around a week, week old, week hatched. So we're just gonna put a little transmitter on him here and weigh in and measure him, put him back in the nest, and this will be the next generation to come through. I guess one of the main messages here is how close these birds are living to people that they're not living miles away in the big bush. They're living right here amongst working farms and that's a, a road there in the background. So it's been a bit of a busy first day out of the nest for this little fella, but um, hopefully we'll be able to use him to help encourage and inspire the community to get in behind and, and help save these things in their area. And as you can see, uh, they're well worth saving. He's just gone straight in under Dad and it's all cool.